I'm Richard Heathcote, I'm the senior photographer for major events for Getty Images. I'm Robert Chanflani, photographer with Getty Images. We have over 80 members of staff here, including photographers, editors, support staff, guys selling the pictures as well for us to all different clients. I hope this is a bit of an insight to what goes into how we produce the images we do. This picture here, it's a remote camera in the roof of short track speed skating. This particular camera is set up over one of those corners and this is from the first night, almost like the second race, and it came off straight away so I was quite pleased. Um, we've got the two skaters just wiping out, sliding across the floor, and this camera's just looking straight down. This is a start shot of the team pursuit looking down the straight with a long lens. Uh, I chose to go with a, a 400mm lens with a converter and chose a slow shutter speed with the red uniform onto the white ice and the slow shutter speed gives it a nice blur, a blur effect but you can still make out the athletes as they take off on the start line. Cover a lot of sports that uh, we don't normally see so it's quite interesting to kind of, you have to use your, your eye as a photographer, you get a little bit more creative maybe at Olympic Games. Something like this curling shot here. Just try to be very visual, try and use colours, try and use patterns. And this is actually a half second exposure. Typically if you're doing a pan of a race car or something like that, you'd be using much faster shutter speed because they're moving so much faster, but the curler's moving so slowly when they're sliding down the ice. You had to use a half a second exposure um, to create this effect. And my other favourite uh, favorite image is from the ski jump. Uh, this was in the first week of competition. I was aiming for a pan of a motion as the skier left the jump. Uh, this was with a 7200mm lens, uh, handheld. Um, I got the movement that I, I desired, but it actually took a bit of time as I was so cold and trying to stay warm at the same time, it made it very difficult to do my job, uh, but I feel happy with the image in the end. Thank you.